I didn't actually always know that I wanted to work in the environmental sector. Um, originally my interest kind of came about through wanting to work um, to make the UK fairer, more equal, um, so really I was driven by um, interest in social justice. I actually studied law at university um, and worked in law and then finance um, before deciding that I wanted to work in sustainability and make a difference through my career. Um, I think I knew for a long time that I wanted to do a job that helped people and the more I learned about the climate crisis and the planet I realised that doing a job in the environment sector was a way to do this. Um, so I decided to apply for the Green Alliance Graduate Scheme because it's quite difficult to find entry level roles um, in the environmental sector so I knew I would. I think particularly the thing that appealed to me is that there was an opportunity to work across a really wide range of different policy areas and kind of find out what I was most interested in. I had seen this grad scheme um, from towards the end of my degree and I'd always known I wanted to apply. Um, it just seemed like a really good um, access point for the sector um, and I could see there was some good training available during the, the year. So my high point at Green Alliance um, has probably been attending some events with really high profile public figures. Um, so we did one with Ed Miliband and Sadiq Khan and another one which both of which were so informative and it was so exciting to be that close to um, really high profile public, public figures. My biggest achievement working at Green Alliance would be working on our Net Zero Policy Tracker uh, which got a lot of mainstream um, press and my name was mentioned in the Times and on a quote. We did an event in the, uh, after COP27 we did an event in um, the Canada House, so um, the speeches from the Canadian ambassador to the UK, as well as some vice chairs like Natalie Bennett, um, which was really cool. Um, and high turnout, believe it or not, people were very keen to go for some nice drinks in the uh, Canadian embassy, but yeah. I think the main thing is just getting to work with people who are really, really passionate about making change and want to make a difference. Um, I think it's a real privilege to, to have a job that where people care so much um, and, yeah, I want to kind of work together to make that change. It's yeah, a really nice environment to be in. Uh, so for future applicants, I would say if you're unsure on your ability or if it's something that you wouldn't normally go for, um, really just go for it and back yourself because environmental policy is for everyone and we need as many people um, from as diverse backgrounds as possible to get involved in this space. Don't hesitate to apply. Um, I almost didn't apply because I was so nervous that it, I wasn't ready or qualified, um, but that's never a good plan. So um, don't hesitate. And even if you feel like you don't meet all the criteria, it's still worth applying because um, we really want to meet everyone.